Today, B1. I know what we should do first, B2. What's that, B1? Have breakfast. Good thinking, B1. <laughs> Let's see what's in the fridge, B2. That's funny, B1. Half of that yummy fruit salad we made yesterday is missing. It can't be, B2. We haven't eaten any yet. We haven't, B1. But somebody has. Look. Someone must have eaten our fruit salad in the night, B2. But who? It's a mystery. A mysterious mystery. Are you thinking what I'm thinking, B1? I think I am, B2. It's, it's Detective, Detective Bananas time! Now let's look for clues. Ow! Sorry, Detective B1. Uh, no problem, Detective B2. I think I found a clue. Look! Hmm, muddy footprints, Detective B2. And they lead right to the fridge, Detective B1. Which means they were made by... The, the Fruit Salad, Salad Snitcher! Let's follow the footprints, Detective B1. Right, Detective B2. Hello, Bananas! So, why are you in your detective gear, Bananas? We've got a mystery to solve, Lulu. Someone ate our fruit salad while we were asleep. But who would do such a thing? The Fruit Salad Snitcher! Uh, bananas, do you mind if I eat the rest of the fruit salad? No, Morgan. The bananas need the rest to catch the snitcher. Do we? Why, Lulu? Because if the snitcher ate half the fruit salad last night, he might come back for more tonight. You're right, Lulu. And if he does... The Detective Bananas will be waiting for him! Let's make a hiding place, Detective B1. So the fruit salad snitcher won't notice us. Hmm. I know, Detective B1. We can pull out the sofas and hide on them. It's nice and comfy, Detective B2. We might have to stay awake all night, Detective B1. Oh, no problem, Detective B2. B2. Let's go and talk to him. Hello? Morgan? What did he say? It sounded like... What does... mean? I think it means he's asleep. Asleep? I've heard about this, Detective B1. It's called, um, sleepwalking. It looks... Like Morgan is also sleep eating. You know what this means, Detective B1? Morgan is the fruit salad snitcher. What should we do, Detective B2? I don't know, Detective B1. We'd better ask the teddies in the morning. You think I ate your fruit salad? You were asleep. Asleep? He was sleepwalking. That's impossible! We saw you! Well, that does explain why there were muddy footprints on our floor this morning. See? 
They match the footprints in our house. Exactly, Detective B2. I'm sorry, Bananas. It's not your fault, Morgan. Well, if I do it again, just wake me up. No, Bananas, don't. It says here you should never wake a sleepwalker. Why not, Lulu? Because they can get a bad fright. Then how do we stop him? Yes, how? <gasps> I know, Bananas. Why don't you just lock your front door? Then Morgan won't be able to get in. Great idea, Lulu. That'll definitely solve the problem. There's someone at the door, B1. Uh, I'll get it, B2. Wait, B1, stop! <laughs> we can't open the door. Why not? Because it must be Morgan, sleepwalking again. He's going away, Detective B1. Then it worked, Detective B2. Let's have some fruit salad to celebrate. That climbing in the window. Oh no, it's Morgan. Oh. He really likes our fruit salad, Detective B1. He certainly does, Detective B2. I ate your fruit salad again. You did. But how could he get in if the door was locked, Bananas? He climbed in through the window. Oh dear. Dear, well, if that didn't stop him, what else can we try? I've got an idea, Bananas. Seven, eight, nine. How many more do I have to do, Amy? As many as you can, Morgan. Oh. Amy, I still don't understand how all this exercise will stop Morgan sleepwalking. <laughs> Bananas. If we wear Morgan out, he'll sleep so deeply he won't have any energy to sleepwalk. Oh, that is good thinking, Amy. Very good thinking. Oh, I can't do any more. Just a few star jumps then. Oh, do I have to? Come on, Morgan. We'll do them with you. Won't we, Detective B1? Uh, if you say so, Detective B2. But Morgan might have to show us how. All right. Watch this, Bananas. One, two, see? It's easy. Come on, Bananas. Ready, set, go! Wake up, Detective B1. What is it, Detective B2? Morgan's back again. Look. Oh, no. What's he doing, Detective B2? Poor Morgan. All that exercise has made him so tired. He can't even sleepwalk without taking a nap. Where's he going now, Detective B1? I don't think he knows, Detective B2. We'd better stay close, Detective B1. There's no telling what he might run into. Quick, he's going to hit the chair. Oof! Now he's heading for the table. <laughs> he's got the fruit salad out, Detective B1. But does he have the energy to eat it, Detective B2? Bananas? Neither do we, Teddies. Looks like we'll just have to stop making fruit salad. Our favourite breakfast. Oh. Wait a minute, Bananas. I think I've got an idea. What is it, Morgan? Well, what if I didn't have to sleepwalk to get the fruit salad? What if the fruit salad came to me instead? Uh, how could the fruit salad do that? It doesn't have any legs, does it? No, I mean, what if the fruit salad was where I could get it without having to sleepwalk? Are you thinking what I'm thinking, B1? I think I am, B2. It's 
fruit salad at Teddy's time. There you go, Morgan. A nice fresh bowl of fruit salad right by your bed. So now if you get hungry in the night, you won't have to walk anywhere. I'm sure this will work. So are we, Morgan. Good night, bananas. Good, Good night, night, Morgan. Well, Detective B1, that's another case solved. Yes, Detective B2, the Detective Bananas have done it again. Ah, uh, there's just one problem, Detective B1. What's that, Detective B2? Well, now that our fruit salad is at the Teddy's place, what happens if we get hungry in the night? Oh dear, that is a problem. Bananas? What are you doing here? Oh, sorry, Morgan. We just got a bit hungry, that's all. Oh, bananas. Would you mind if I had some too? Of course not, Morgan. Mmm, thanks. What's going on? We thought the fruit salad was supposed to be for Morgan. Uh, we're sorry, Teddies. It looked so delicious. We just couldn't resist coming over to have some too. Oh, bananas. <laughs> <laughs> Congratulations, Morgan. Oh, it's time for bed, everyone. But I'm not tired yet. <sighs> then why are you yawning? I'm not yawning. Not much, anyway. Mm. <sighs> 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 okay, Tori, it's time for bed. That's funny. Where's Kevin? Kevin! Where are you? What's wrong? It's Kevin, my fluffy buddy. He should be on the pillow with my other toys, but he's gone. Oh, don't worry, Morgan. He'll be around somewhere. He's not. And I can't go to sleep without him. Let's look. He's not on the sofa. He's not under the sofa. Oh, he's lost. We're never going to find him. I'm sure we'll find your bunny tomorrow. Tomorrow? But I can't go to sleep without Kevin. What a quiet night, B1. Quiet and peaceful, B2. I want my fluffy bunny! Did you hear that, B1? Someone sounds upset at the Teddy's house. Hello, Amy. Amy. Bananas, what brings you here so late? Uh, we heard a noise. Is everything all right? No, Kevin is missing. Poor Kevin, that's terrible. Uh, who is Kevin? A pink fluffy bunny. And I can't go to sleep without him. This is even more serious than we thought, B2. Are you thinking what I'm thinking, B1? I think I am, B2. It's Detective Bananas time! Wait here, Teddies. Where are you going? To change into our special detective clothes. The Detective Bananas are on the case, Morgan. Just lead us to the scene of the crime. Kevin should be on my pillow, but he's not. Hmm. What do you think, Detective B2? Hmm. 
I think he's definitely not on the pillow, Detective B1. So where is he? Don't worry, Morgan. We'll find Kevin for you. The Detective Bananas always get their bunny. Now, do you have a photo of the missing bunny? I think so. Here he is. Hmm, that's very odd, Detective B1. Kevin looks exactly like Morgan. That is Morgan, Detective B2. Kevin is the one with the floppy ears. Oh, silly me. So, does Kevin have any other friends? Well, he is friendly with Bruce. Ah, ah Bruce. Bruce. Can we talk to Bruce? If you want to. Here he is. Hello, Bruce. When did you last see Kevin? Hmm? He won't talk, Detective B1. Of course he won't talk, Bananas. He's a toy. <laughs> so he is. <laughs> bananas, we really don't think Kevin is in the house. Why not? Because Morgan was carrying Kevin around all day. So he could have left him anywhere in Cuddlestown. Aha! Then we know exactly how to find him. How? All we have to do is go everywhere that Morgan went. And we're sure to find the missing bunny. The Detective Bananas are on the case. We think it's funny. Funny. This fluffy bunny. Bunny. Has disappeared without a trace. We have to find him. And remind him. should ask Morgan where he went today. Otherwise, you'll end up looking everywhere in Cuddlestown. Sounds good to me, B2. So, Morgan, where was the first place you went today? We went to Rat's Shop. I'm sure I left Kevin at Rat's Shop. Then Rat's Shop it is, Detective B1. Rat, are you awake? Sleep. Sorry, Rat, but we're on an urgent case. Kevin is missing. That's terrible! Uh, who is Kevin? Morgan's fluffy bunny. His bunny? Morgan left him here this morning. And I can't get to sleep without him. We have to search the whole shop from top to bottom. Never mind. Sorry, Rat. Detective work can be messy. Uh, very messy, Detective B1. I don't think Kevin is here, Bananas. Neither do I. They could be right, Detective B1. But if he's not here, where is he? Where did you go next, Morgan? We went to Charlie's place. That's it. I'm sure I left Kevin at Charlie's place. Charlie's place it is, Detective B1. Oh, wait, Bananas. What about this mess? Oh, uh, sorry, Rat. Grab that broom, Detective B1. No problem, Detective B2. It's clean-up time. Oops. All right, I agree. Your detective work is far too important to waste time here. We're happy to stay and help. No, 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 no. Off you go. I insist. Thanks, Rat. Bye. 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 Oh, cheese and whiskers. So you think Morgan left a bunny here? A fluffy bunny called Kevin. And I can't go to sleep without him. I don't remember seeing him, but if you want to take a look... Thanks, Charlie. Can you see Kevin anywhere, Detective B2? No, Detective B1. Why don't we dust for paw prints? Good idea, Detective B2. 
What are you doing, Bananas? Looking for Kevin's paw prints with our special paw print finding dust. Hmm, but how does it work? Simple, Charlie. We just put some dust on our brush, like so. Then brush it over everything to see if Kevin's paw prints are anywhere. So we'll know if he's been here. Watch. <laughs> Can you see any paw prints, Detective B1? I can't see anything at all, Detective B2. <laughs> <coughs> any sign of Kevin, Bananas? No, Morgan. Any sign of him over here, Teddies? No, Bananas. Oh, dear. So where did you go next, Morgan? Um, we just went home. <gasps> Poor Kevin. Where can he be? Don't worry, Morgan. We're sure to find him tomorrow. But what about tonight? How will I get to sleep without him? That's a problem, Detective B1. A big problem, Detective B2. Hmm. Are you thinking what I'm thinking, Detective B1? I think I am, Detective B2. It's bunny making time! Bunny making? We'll make you a new bunny to take to bed. A new bunny? But... That's brilliant, Bananas. I'll get some material. And I'll get the sewing kit. And, and we'll, we'll get, get some stuffing. stuffing. And I'll... I'll go to my room. <sighs> huh? That's funny. Kevin! You were here all along. You naughty bunny. Wait till I tell the others. How's the bunny's head going, Teddies? Nearly finished. How's the bunny's body going, Bananas? Almost done. Bananas, look what I found. Sorry, Morgan. Can't look now. We're busy sewing the bunny's tail on. Lulu, Amy, look. Sorry, Morgan. Can't look now. We're busy making the new bunny's ears. Oh, well. Come on, Kevin. There. All done. He's perfect, Detective B1. And so cute and cuddly, Detective B2. What do you think, Morgan? Where is Morgan? I think he went to his room. Ta-da! Meet your new bunny, Morgan. Morgan? He's asleep. And look what he's cuddling. It's, it's Kevin, Kevin the Fluffy Bunny. He must have been in Morgan's bed all along. Well, Detective B1, that's another case solved. Thanks for your help, Bananas. Yes, thank you. No problem, Teddies. Actually, there is one problem, Detective B2. What's that, Detective B1? Morgan won't need this bunny now. So what will we do with it? I think I might have an idea, Detective B1. Good night, B1. Good night, B2. And, and good, good night, night, little bunny. bunny. Sweet dreams. <laughs> <laughs>